Hey everyone, this is Judy with JLB Crafts. Welcome back to my channel, and if you're new here, thank you so much for giving me a try. You guys, I am so excited. I haven't been this excited about something new in a really long time. Um, Planners Anonymous has come out with a new size of a product that they've had that I've that has been drool worthy for a long, long time now. They have um, had for a while now a, a planner called a Melody, and it's a hybrid. You can do strings like a traveler's notebook or a um, <clears throat> rings bound system, or a, um, a you can use it for a mini happy planner. Well, I don't use a mini, I use a classic, and for a long, long time I've wished that they made their melodies in a classic size. Guess what? And not only that but it's in one of my favorite kits of theirs of all time sakura you guys if you followed me for a while you know that um i lived and worked in japan for a while and i just love all things asian and um sakura is one of my favorite seasons so for them to bring out the very first classic size melody in sakura is just like my fondest wish come true so let's get a look at this um, this is the bag it comes in. It's a little drawstring printed bag that you can keep it in. You can throw it in this, um, in your, in your backpack or your suitcase if you're traveling. Um, this is just, uh, beautiful. I love it. I love the purples and the only thing that would be make, make it better was if it had my favorite color, like an olive earthy sage green, but if this is, many, many of their kits have melodies. Um, not every kit, but many kits. And um, I hope that this sells well enough. It's not cheap, um, but it's good quality for what you get. So without further ado, I'm not gonna keep talking and just showing you the same thing. Let's see what it looks like. So this is the Melody, Melody classic size Melody. Um, let's get it out of the plastic. I got this last night. And I, it was so hard to resist opening it up until I could film. So here we go. This is the outside. It comes with, this is tucked in. So this back side has a great big, great, great big pocket. I mean, you could probably fit a whole sticker book in there. Um, let me just see. Yep, it's a tight fit, but it definitely fits in there. So a sticker book fits in that pocket. Um, so for those of you, and then this is just a, a little magnetic clasp, so you don't have to worry about the snap popping off. This is, um, I'm not sure exactly what the proper term is, but it's a faux leather, like a vegan leather. Um, but it is oh, so smooth. The stitching is absolutely perfect. This is not, it's not fake little plastic stitching. It's actual real stitching. And you guys, there are so many pockets in this. So for those of you that don't know, Traveler's Notebooks are probably the original original notebooks. They're just, this one is literally just a piece of leather with a rubber band holding it shut. And then there are strings, these rubber band things. And all it is is just pieces of paper folded in half, stapled in the center, and you slide them into the elastic, right? So you can have one of these a month or one for a year or just, and it just literally goes inside the string. So these were originally designed for traveler's notebooks for strings, right? Then they added, um, and I don't have the attachment because it costs extra and I don't need it, but if you like those planners that are ring, ring bound, so the ones that are like the, the three ring binder from high school or junior high that snap open, um, there's a little hole here. There's a hole here and a hole here. I don't know if you can see them, but you can buy um, the binder attachment piece that has, I believe there are six rings, they're like three and three, um, but you can use just it's super easy to put in there and attach. Um, so it's got the strings, you can buy the attachment for the rings, and then you can also, this one is sized for a happy planner. Um, so that's part of the reason why I made this cover because I had already ordered this and I knew it was coming. So all you do is slide 
your planner cover into the back and it's not and sometimes um, it might be easier I'm just gonna pop the cover off and this is a nice snug fit so this is not gonna fall out but it's just basically another pocket and it slides as you can see it slides way way in there and then now that it's slid in I'm gonna pop it back on the discs And that doesn't use your only pocket. There's another pocket here, right? So, and then it, it goes shut. And these are my big discs. These aren't quite as big as expanders. If you watch my video um, for my move in for and flip through for March, which should be up very soon, these are big discs. And then it, it folds shut, snap the front, and look, there's still tons and tons of room in there. So you could absolutely put expander discs in here. So that is how the cover works. Um, and look, I still can use these strings. So let's say I want to take, remember my washi tape swatch book? I will link this in the cards up above. I can take this with me. I just slide it into a string and bam, I can take it with me and it fits. If I need to travel, there we go. It's in there and there's still tons of room to spare. Um, sometimes the special extra gift that comes with the Planners Anonymous kits, sometimes you get um, this little pouch, right, that you can put Planners Anonymous stickers and other things in. I've seen this. I forget who showed this the first time. But look at this. Just, I put it under the string. I snap it shut. Now I can take it with me. So I have just, I have wanted a cover that also had strings for my Happy Planner for so, so long, you guys. And I love, like I said, I love the uh, melodies in particular that um, Planners Anonymous, I'm, I'm so excited I'm like losing my words. Um, I've wanted the, the Planners Anonymous version for so long because it's just not garish inside. Look at all these pockets, you guys. Look at this. I love the way they do this diagonal design and they're all lined. They're lined with like a rayon material. They're not, and the stitching is real. That's real stitching. And there's another one here and another one here. I mean, it's just, like I said, it's not, it's not super cheap and they don't usually go on sale, although you can earn loyalty points after you've subscribed for a while and use those. But you guys, I love it. I love it so, so much. Um, you can put, probably, I'm sure, I can put a Happy Planner sticker book down in here maybe. Nope, it's not a deep enough pocket. Um, I could put it here just to kind of have it in there. Yeah, that pocket goes all the way down. It's just this top one, it's not all the way deep, which is probably good. I'd probably lose something in there. That one's almost deep enough, not quite, but this one definitely is. So there, I can stick it down in there. Still, look at it, so much room. Oh my gosh, there's just so much room in there, you guys. So anyway, okay. So stay tuned. This obviously is not gonna work with a transformer planner um, because you'd have to pull it out every time you wanna transform it. There also is a pen loop here. So I can use one of my gorgeous, um, I think this is the Sakura pen. Put that in there. Um, so when you do a transformer planner, your middle set of covers does stick out a bit. Um, so there is that to worry about, but it does lay okay on my pen. I mean, I'm not having any issue at all closing it with those covers. There's plenty, plenty, plenty of room. Um, plenty of room. Even my pen is in there, no problem. So, however, it's not going to be able to transform. So we don't actually need two sets of covers. So I actually, what I could do is just take the back cover off and use these as my dividers to go from section to section, right? So here's one planner. Here's my, my next planner. And then this would be my third planner. So I could just do one set of covers and not transform. And I would just need to decide what order I want my three planners in. Um, so that's an option. So stay tuned. Um, I will film another video. I'm going to play with different ways of setting this up, different things to put in here. Um, you could probably use this if you want it. So 
if you're going to write, if you're going to open to a page um, in your planner and write, you may not want a bunch of super lumpy stuff, but then you write on both sides, right? So I don't know if it really matters if you have the strings um, on the left side or you could use this and slide your front cover in here probably. I don't know, let's see. And then have the back cover be the loose side and then your strings would be in back. So yeah, this seems like it's definitely gonna slide in there, no problem. Again, nice and snug so your planner isn't gonna slide out of there. Um, Anyway, it looks like it'll go in. Yep, it'll definitely go all the way in. So you could use this um, attached to your front cover rather than your back cover. And then the strings would be behind your planner. Um, anyway, let me show you what else I ordered. They had a bunch of different accessories. So um, the original Sakura kit came with these three washies, the one with the kitties and the flowers, the one with the lanterns, and then this pink one with the gold speckles. Well, they did come out with more washies. Um, this one, and I will, um, I will pause this and get these open. So here's a sister washi to that one. It's the dark plum color with the gold speckles. Um, and then here is a me medium size washi. So this matches um, the the paper that I used for my cover. It's got the the branches with the flower the um, cherry blossoms coming down off of it. Um, and then this one and one other, these are actual flakies. They're loose leaf flowers and they're individual just stacked up on here. Um, and then I have the other one I'm still waiting on is um, individual petals. So I'll pause that and get the, those open. But a couple other things I wanted to show you. I got the um, little notepad. And one of the things I've seen them do is um, slide this in here into these pockets just to have a notepad handy. There you go. Love that. Um, I did get some additional stickers. So this is considered a, this is a daily kit. Um, so this is different than the stickers that come with, sorry for the noise. This is different than the stickers that actually come with the monthly subscription kit. Um, these are slightly bigger sticker pages, so we've got, but they definitely match. I mean, so we've got lots of deco here, the same girl, the kitties, the wax melts. Here are, it comes with more of the full box stickers. So pretty. We have this one. Um, so pretty. Here it's got some washi-like strips. <coughs> Excuse me. Some functional words. And a, a set of date covers. We've got some functional boxes here and some habit trackers. And then we've got more functional boxes, to-do lists, um, water trackers. So I could definitely do a spread in my um, wellness planner with this. And then we've got more um, <clears throat> functional stuff on this page. The icons, the date, the month covers, um, some functional words, some like bill do and other things. Um, so very functional sticker kit for this. <clears throat> um, I also got the planner charm. They don't always come out with a planner charm, but I'm so glad that they did for this one. This is so pretty. And let me show you how to attach it. So another, yet another reason, and a little art card, yet another reason I've been wanting the strings. And this is, this is silly because there are other workarounds. But so here's the charm. It's an origami crane attached to a flower and a little lobster, a little lobster clasp. And so what you can do with this to attach it to your Melody Classic, Classic Size Melody Planner cover. So when they put the strings into these, they have these little attachment points. Here it says PA right there, Planners Anonymous. But they have these little attachment points. So you can attach a charm to each of these. Let's see if I can do it, there we go. And there is my Sakura charm on there. I love it, I love it, I love it. Um, I actually have a couple little cat charms that I can put on there as well. 
So, oh, so cute. I've wanted this for so long, you guys. Okay, and then the last thing I ordered um, was these, this set of dividers. So you can order an entire, um, if you don't like any of the planners that are out there right now, you can get as part of your subscription an entire, um, each kit comes with its own month of printable, a printable planner setup. Um, in all the different sizes you can possibly think of and it's th it's themed to match the kit so so you've got your your weekly layout with um it's vertical i believe so three boxes and seven days a week and then it's got it's the space on that one is on the um, right hand side instead of the left hand side like a traditional happy planner vertical um, it comes with tabs it comes with goal pages it comes with so many different things and like i said it's themed to match the kit the kit is made to go with um, those pages. I didn't, I didn't order all that, although I am thinking about it. But since it's a digital download that you can just order and print yourself, um, I can get it at any point in time. But this is a physical, a physical thing. It's a set, it's a cover and a set of two, four, six dividers, and they are sized so that I can put. You can, you can bind them and use them with strings or tape them in there somehow, I don't know. You could punch them for the six um, rings, the three and the three, six rings, if that's what you want. I can disc punch them and use them as dividers in a classic size Happy Planner. They match the planners. Um, it's, the, it's perfect, it's the exact right size. So there's a cover page, I can put my name in there. Um, here it's, it talks about compatible planners, so the Happy Planner Classic. Um, and then here's one, so pretty. And you just get your label maker out or you use a Happy Planner sticker, remember to do, important, that kind of thing. There we go. This one's got the, um, all the papers, it just, it matches the papers from the kit, right? And especially if you get the extra paper pack, I believe these are the same six papers. So, so pretty, so pretty, the kitties. And the cover, yep, these, I believe these match the cover. So I can punch these with my Happy Planner Disc Punch and use them for a whole new section in my planner or I can make them six months or you know whatever I wanna do. So let me pause this and get that washi tape opened up so I can roll it out for you. Okay, so last but not least is the, um, the washies. So I'm just gonna go ahead and put out the original three that came with the kit as a reminder. So there's one with the kitties hiding in the flowers. Here's the medium sized one, which has the dark flowers with the Chinese lan or the Japanese lanterns. And then here's the super skinny with the speckles. And then the new washi that I got, so it has these individual petals. So they come off the roll as one strip, but they're individual stickers. Um, they call them petals or some, I think that they call them flakies if they're individual stickers on their own little piece of backing or acetate. I think on a roll like this, they're considered petals. Even though this is, these are actual full flowers, um, they're stuck on here individually. And so they're considered sticker petals. Um, there we go. So these would be great. Maybe I'll do my lettering planner with these this week um, since they're all individual and I can just kind of sprinkle them all around. Yeah, maybe I will because I could use the skinny washi for the lines in between the, the days in my horizontal. And then these I could sprinkle down the center and along the edges. So anyway, so there's a few. There are, I forget um, how many different design she said we're on here it's a bunch though I think she said like maybe eight or twelve or ten or something like that so but I'm not gonna pull them all off of there and then I got this another medium size washi which again this has the gold the gold foil and it's got that design of the paper with the um, where you're up under the tree with the branches coming down there's a lot of foil on that one it's almost hard to see the design underneath it and then um, again, the other skinny washi, which is the sister washi to this one. 
their opposites. So that's all the washi. Um, oh, there is one more coming. I haven't gotten that order yet, but it's it's the same style as this one. It's just that instead of having five petaled flowers, it's the actual individual petals and they're a little bit larger. So maybe I'll wait until I get that one and then I'll use the combination of the two to do my lettering planner for the week. Um, I think that that's a definite. So there we go. That is um, my my melody. I stuck another charm on here that I've been waiting to have um, the opportunity to stick on here. So I've got a kitty um, on a string and the one that goes with the melody. Um, classic size melody. So I hope you like this video. Have a look. I'm not an affiliate or anything. I just really, again, I love um, the Planners Anonymous products. They're so beautiful. I love the artwork style. The color saturation is amazing. I could just go on and on, but I'm not going to. So um, I hope you like this video. I hope it, it is intriguing to you and you will give Planners Anonymous a look. Please consider liking and subscribing. Thank you.